warm up, mapping space and equipment. A great starting point in a sensory tennis warm up is mapping the space and equipment. It's important for us to familiarise ourselves with our surroundings and get a sense of the space in which we are working so we can feel comfortable and settled. We see two young men exploring the space including the walls, floor and tennis net, feeling it with their hands to build up a tactile picture of their environment. We see a young girl feeling the tactile court markings with her feet. Once we have mapped the space, it's time to familiarise ourselves with the equipment. We see a young girl feeling different types of balls and running her hand across a racket. Here you are beginning to introduce the use of external stimulus. This is also a great way of familiarising yourself with the activity you are about to complete. Although this is part of a warm up, you may want to regularly return to this activity throughout your sessions. Make it easier. Provide more support, guidance and direction to the participant when exploring the space. Suggest pieces of equipment for the participant to explore and support them to feel each item. Spend longer exploring one piece of equipment in more detail. Make it harder. Encourage a participant to explore the environment more independently. Try exploring new, different pieces of equipment. Encourage the participant to notice differences in shape, size, weight and texture. Sensory Tennis Produced in partnership with Lusu and the Lawn Tennis Association. Sense. No one left out of life. Sense.org.uk